Well, millions in the Buckeye State had their Labor Day plans confirmed today. Ohio State will begin their defense of their undisputed National College Football Championship on Labor Day. And we now know their game at Virginia Tech will kick off at 8 p.m. Buckeyes will play at least four primetime games next season. Austin Scott, always ready for primetime, scoots in with the latest edition of the Layfield Welding Top 5 Plays of the Week. We start off the countdown with Mac baseball between Delphi St. John's and New Bremen. James Cronenberger hits a chopper to third. Josh Warnicke scoops, spins, and fires to first for the out. What a great play by the sophomore. We rewrite the Shawnee softball record books at number four. Pitcher Alyssa Window gets the strikeout in the top of the first inning against Salina to become the Lady Indian single season strikeout record holder. Congratulations to Alyssa, and there's more to come from this game. Blue Jays baseball also lands on the third spot this week. Aaron Rindell at the dish against Wayne Trace, and he goes to deep center, and it's gone. He clears the bases with a three-run homer. DSJ gets the win 16-4. Back to Shawnee for play number two this week. We saw her on the countdown a few weeks back and she makes her return in a big way. Matt Finkel has the call. Donovan's pitch, driven no left, deep. Brooke Steinbrenner going back and it's gone. A solo home run for Chloe Wolgenmuth, her fifth of the season gives Shawnee a one to nothing lead. A great Putnam County matchup takes top honors this week. Miller City hosting Kaleida in a battle of state ranked teams. With the bases loaded, Ross Lehman goes deep. Spaloosh! A grand slam. We're not even sure where this ball ended up. Miller City gets the big win in this one, 17-7. Thanks to Layfeld Welding for supporting our countdown each and every week. And check back next week for more Round Trippers. <laughs>